some undies. Never know what we're gonna find. Woohoo! Hopefully that's in there. What size? Yes, yes, yes. No way. <laughs> oh, what is it? That's oh, oh, gold. Gold. It looks like a gauge in the ring right here. Could be a diamond. Everybody, how are we doing today? Just Jeff and I. We're whooped. We drove three hours because of this. But we're gonna find so much other treasure in the storage unit. We're gonna get a chance to even try to attempt to break in here. We moved it. Sounds like something's in there. And with everything else in the unit, there's probably something out there. So I just wanted to start a quick video. If you haven't subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. Check out all the other videos from this locker. Oh, mind blowing, unbelievable. Appreciate you. Don't forget, thumbs up, share with your friends. And I mean, this unit, I would say, look in the bag. What we got? Boom. This thing. Ooh. Little Kodak Star. You have to look them up. Could be worth money. ACDC. Back and black. Red Wings Hockey Puck, Copperhead BBs, Steve, his Hockey Puck, maybe we should get back to him just Jeff. What is this thing? Exploder Game Cartridge, the world's most powerful game code cartridge for the Sony PlayStation? Woo! Crazy. More pellets and BBs and yeah, Joe. See Metallica, Rob Zombie, Kid Rock, Metallica, more Metallica, Kid Rock. Oh. Just in the bottom here. Just sitting there. Got a bike down here. Hats. Man, it's like a Kid Rock hat right there. Yeah, it's Kid Rock all day long. Oh man. Speaking of Kid Rock. Halo figure. Gears of War figure. Oh. <laughs> Ghost Rider number two. Ghost Rider number three. Number four, five, six, seven. Where's number one? But still, ten cent. The Ghost Rider. That's probably before you get taken over. Wow, I love my Marvel comic group. What else could be in here? Undertaker. Uh, girls of something. Bikini babe. Made of crystal. Never know, just Jeff. Just never know. You know, I'm beginning to believe that. You just never know? You're not lying when you say that. Robert, uh, little Detroit Red Wings, Walking Dead books, or more comic related stuff, books, model. Oh! G.I. Joe weapons, G.I. Joe weapons. I mean, Looks all... like, is there something wrapped up in that green shirt? I think is so. That just the way... There's a bag in here. Yeah. What's in this bag? Yeah. Oh, it's heavy. Everything's been heavy. Alice Cooper. CDs. Autographs. More CDs in there. It's going for the big part. The I'm biggest trying... part in here. I'm trying to get there. Queen, Punisher, it's not in there. Most of the stuff's been inside. Oh, oh, oh. oh, it's not in there, I think. But just that case is what's in there. Game Boy Advance, that's cute. And that's the thing, this thing I just thought was a bag of garbage. 
And then you're pulling out stuff. That's like a faceplate, but it's not in there. Huh. All right, what's in the big coat just, Jeff? I said it's big enough I to put think, a body in. I think it's got 30 figures in it. 30 figures? Or cars, auto cars. <laughs> I think you're wrong. I think I am wrong. What is it? It's a box for one of those BB guns. Socket set. I, I, Socket I think set. I see a figure. You do? You do. Halo remote control. Paintball mask. Here, let oh, me, let me hold this. I got this. So you can... WWF figure. Black sword book. But underneath here. Oh. So who knows? I won't have to go through it all. But definitely paintball stuff. We've got comic books just thrown in here. No rhyme, no reason. CDs, military canteen. More paintball stuff. More paintball, I guess. We got so much more to load up. And uh, all these totes left. Let me go through one more here. Are we gonna have enough time? Yeah, we gotta go. Oh man. More models. Display case for models. Carefully. Models. Models. What's models. the date on that paper? 2004. 2004. Oh, wow. 20 years ago. So. I said almost every coat, every box in here. Full collectibles. We got these totes still to go, all those boxes, that big old box, and the safe. Who knows what else we're gonna find, but we gotta get back to Cleveland and we'll open this at the shop. So we just ran out of time in Michigan. We had to come back, load up all the stuff. This is all the stuff that we didn't get to look through. And that whole back wall, all these boxes, there's a little bit of everything in them. So let's go ahead and see what we got. <laughs> Boom. Plymouth Roadrunner, American Muscle, and a 70 El Camino. And I can tell you what, he paid. I like both those. Yeah, these are probably 40 bucks, 50 bucks a piece. Books Star Wars, Stephen King. Stephen King. So definitely has money. All these hardcover books, dust jacket. I sometimes wish I read. We do too. Oh, comic books. You just don't know what's going to be in here. First, Dark Hawk. One, two, three, five. So he's got a whole, it looks like all Dark Hawks, all the way. Well, you know, he's you definitely know, missing some, but he's got. You know what they call those? A run? A run, yeah. Nice. I learned that. Let's see what we got here. Hopefully, we got more runs. Yep. Shadowhawk. Predator? It's, nope, we got mixed books. It's the only hobby I know where you like to get the runs. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Night Watch. Just saying. Adult comics. These have money. Whoop. Final fan for a whole mixture of books. Oh, right there. That's a money book. Spar number one. Now, does he ever run a spawn? No. Curse of Spawn. West Coast Avengers. So, the whole mixture of comics and the plastic will stick together. Transformers. These are newer ones. Hawkman. Witchblade. So, you have some of those that are not bagged. Yeah, some, some that are bagged, yes. and very few that are boarded. All right, this is not bagged. This is bagged and boarded. And this is just bagged. 
Most people that bag and board them, like they just read them once and then put them in there. Or Some way just, I read them. Really? Wolverine. Black hood. Plasma. Gotham Knights. Batman Adventures number one. That's cool. Now the question is, do you have other Batman Adventures? Perfect. Rotted. There's an old one. Conan magazine, at least. Curse of Conan. So, just out of curiosity, should I be happy or sad that you didn't get the runs in this box? Well, depends on what the runs are. Mike's liking the runs. Ooh, here's Dan Perella. Those are always worth some money. So, we got a whole bunch of sci fi books, Born Ultimatum, and so the whole group. Oh, look at G.I. Joe. That's pretty cool. Live. The live adventure. So this is when, like, choose your adventure books. The G.I. Joe. Morato. Naruto, whatever. There's a bunch of books in here. Definitely worth some money. So don't overlook books. Look at those. Marvel Universe. Zombies. Walking Dead. So Walking Dead, it would be nice to have a whole run of those get the first one. Why don't you turn that box around so... I can't see it. I'm not going to be able to see what it is. We need to see. Well, you need you to can see upside down. You should down. stand behind me. I don't like you standing behind me. How am I going to read a comic book upside down? You can do that. Transformers number one, number two. So there's a run of Transformers. There you go. Undertaker comic book number one. Firebrand number one. Exo, and here's the Smackdown. Nice. Vamp nude edition. Uh oh. We better be careful here. But. So this is all Vampirellas, and uh, I think this is the whole new edition, and I'm sure it's worth money. Highlander, Amazing Spider-Man. Amazing Spider-Man, Amazing Spider-Man. So there's a big one. There you go. Avengers, Infinity Crisis. Huh. Electra, 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 X-Men, Spider-Man, Wolverine. Even the ones that aren't bagged look like to be in good condition. Yeah, it's amazing. The way they store them. Which one is he going to pick next? The box. Do -do -do -do. That's your call. Oh, the back's coming out. Unless that's the top. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, 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 this could be a really good box. And that's the reason I like this shirt. Walking Dead. That's pretty cool. What size? Double XL. Oh, that's my size. This is your size, though. The Detroit Red Wings jersey. Is this thing? Fallout Xbox 360. That's probably worth money because it's like a collector box. It feels like it's all in there. Oh, that's what's in there. And the guys don't know the game or anything. Reaction. Kind of pull. 38 32. Oh. I could have fit in those couple summers ago. <laughs> How many summers? A couple few. Two blue jersey. So all these clothes are worth money. Some nice clothes in here. Look at this, brand new. Price tag, Jeff? 89. 50 bucks. I like it. The 2X? Yeah. Yeah? Uh, nope. I think so. Oh. Some undies. 
Never know what we're gonna find. Woohoo! Hopefully that's in there. What size? This size, Jeff. What a uh, ninety-five bucks. That's a real Bowie knife right there, boy. Yeah. Why do they call it a Bowie knife? Didn't expect to see that in an elf. There's got to be something else in here. Now you got me revved up. You just don't know about this thing, isn't it? Oh, I see something shiny down there. Video games. <laughs> a mouse nest or something. Oh, I like the orange jacket. Military. It's a hunting vest. Looks like jersey, but there's no name on it. Hunting vest. What size? Not your size. I'm, I'm liking that. It'll it go with... extra grande. Uh, you look extra grande. I might give that a You don't look like mucho grande. <laughs> Still know what I'm going to find in here. Detroit Pistons shirt. Lots of magazines down here. <laughs> What's this? Oh, it's not in there. That's where I found You one. found some knives though, didn't you? Yeah, this could be one of the ones we found earlier. These look like brand new. Carhartt? Come on, 40 waist. 3830. Oh. I could fit in those. You probably could. Those probably would be good for you. 3829. Man. Brand new. Got more military stuff down here. There's definitely a mouse nest in here. Toe time? Uh, yep. Toe time? Toe time. Oh, man, that looks awesome. Heavy. Oh, it's all books, magazines. Oh, this must be for a bunch of the different figures that we built already. We found that one box. <laughs> Transformers. It's one of the dinosaur ones, I think. We got a bunch of Transformers in here. Listed. Stop monkeying around. I don't know. I'll get to work. I'll get to work. modern Navy battleships. It's a game. Probably worth money. Battle tech. This looks like one of the originals. Well, this could be worth some cash right here. This is a very popular game. This looks like. It might be like a first edition. If you check it out, see when it came out. Whoops. Oh, we got CDs down there. What is in here? Oh, binoculars or something all wrapped up. What the heck? Xbox Sealed Warzone. Xbox 2. X-Men 2, PlayStation, all PlayStation, SmackDown, Nintendo, Dino Crisis, all in there. Oh, this is heavy money. Hey, Alice Cooper, you ever see Alice Cooper? Did I ever see him? Mm -hmm. Like In concert? No. Oh my gosh. I do like him though. You'll have a whole new respect if you see him in concert, man. He does a, the theatric show, so good. Unbelievable job. Hot smack. Mega death. ACDC. All the ACDCs. Wow. Pink Floyd the Wall Live. Mega death. Yeah, this is a good, good stack. Poster. We got some old newspapers. See the date on newspaper? 1945. Looks like this is from the war. Wow, 1945. Hmm. Holding history in your hand. I love my job. And holding history in my hand. It's 
why I love my job. Mm -hmm. It's a vintage poster right there. 2005. Yeah, I get it. You, it's almost you, 20 years old. You made an excellent point. I, I, history and history. Just I appreciate it. Two different time periods. Two different time periods. Man. Around here. Budweiser, Steins, Anheuser Busch collectible, Steins, Miller. So another good box. That's the thing, like this, you know, almost, nice collection. almost every box is just, yeah, part of his collection. Oh, speaking of collection. Moonlight in there. Rated T for teens. Another Moonlight. This looks like this might be a, a run of Moonlights. Nope. Hawk, Spider Man. And they're all good titles. She Hawk. I think she's getting married. Ooh, here's an interesting. Oh, 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 this might be good. Looks like maybe some older books in here. I see this store on top. 65 cent door. Some doors can have some value. 390, 362, 400, 396. Lost guys, North door. Ooh, I just see a Grable Hawk, 15 centers. Is that good? Yeah, they're old. Incredible Hawk, Incredible Hawk. Incredible hawk. Definitely has a run. Some incredible hawks. These inspired or spectacular Spider Man 200. Like a few bucks. Avengers. Daredevil. Daredevil 300. So I've got some Daredevils. These are bagged and boarded, so it's just a mixture. There's more Daredevils in here. These are all newer comics. Not bad and boarded. Wolverine. I shouldn't say newer, this guy. Star Wars New 52. But wow, wow, wow. Mega collector. Mega money. I can't wait to see what's in the safe when we get there. I was going to say that I kind of got distracted. I've been thinking about the safe. It's hard to videotape with it right behind me. It's coming. So these are newer. We got X Men, Star Wars, Punisher. So this might be like when he bought them at the store and just put them in the bags. And looks like adult comics, but probably worth money. Lady Death, Lady Death '96. So these are good comics. Really no rhyme or reason for this collection whatsoever. A lot of good stuff though. It's definitely got a lot of adult comics. Star Wars. More Walking Dead. Jedi Tales. Conan. Star Blazers. So I have a whole run of those. Yep, Star Blazers number one. <laughs> Money, money, money. Kane. Rumbleheads. Wrestling stuff's always money. Oh man. The Undertaker figure. The other figure I looked up like this. Oh my gosh, she's got a whole bunch. Oh. You had some of those one time sell really high. These guys are like. $60, $80 a piece. Stone Cold, Undertaker, and The Rock. Wow. Can you smell what The Rock is cooking? 2001. Wow, wow, wow. I know we got a couple other ones, and then down here, brand new Transformers Armada. Transformers Armada. One, two, three. It's more brand new WWF down there. Jericho Bobblehead. More Transformers. And more.
or WWF. Wow. I have no clue what this box. This box is definitely two hundred dollars easily. Oh, VHS tapes, Transformers, Demon Beast one and two. I'm telling you, some of these are worth money. Sealed, The Haunted Mansion, Transformers the movie. And then down here we got all kind of wrestling ones, Transformers, and a few books. But definitely worth money. All right. So we got more VHS. We always got to check in here. Oh, it's not all VHS. We got that. Look down here. Car, Two Hot huh? California, 50 Ford Woody. And then there's wrestling tapes in here. Day of the Dead. So, like I said, some of these Evil Dead too. Like those Evil Dead. The day of the day, but but you that's probably worth some money. Why people buy VHS tapes? I don't know. Why, Jeff? I can't believe you didn't pull the car out. The car is you want to pull awesome. It yeah, it shouldn't be in that box. That Muscle is cool. Machines. I like that. Real steel. Beautiful. Another box of comics. More Daredevil. 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 It's supposed to be like Daredevil in the bag. Transformers. Number one. Ooh. Iron Man. Oh, more of these vampire books. Person, they got a weird collection of books. I'm telling you, there's probably some really good books in here. We got Spider Man. Spider-Man. That's worth some money. Let's see, this is another number one. These are two different. They call it varying covers. I think they made like six different covers for this book. So some are worth more than others. Jimmy Goblin. The wedding album of Superman. Gotta have some money in here. Transformers. Transformers, Transformers, Transformers. Another run of Transformers. This guy did like Transformers, so. So much stuff to go through. <laughs> what the heck is this thing? What the heck? It's like a Transformer dragon, dude. That thing's crazy. There's a lot going on there. There's a lot going on. I have to have you transform him back to a dragon. I don't job. know if I could do it. That's a Joe job. More books. Books and look down here. Holy smoke. Got new Star Wars, but we got Transformers. And this guy's huge right here. Yeah, you're worth money. There's all the brand new Star Wars down here. Brand new. Crazy, it's all like Chinese. Japanese. Hmm. G.I. Joe. I looked at the one set like this, it was like $50. G.I. Joe. And there's a wood card on it. So no rhyme, no reason. Transformers, G.I. Joe, Star Wars. Wow, wow, wow. Another box of fun. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's see. It's going to be a mixed bag, ladies and gentlemen. First, we got something all wrapped up here. A moose. Cocoa Moose. Christmas. M&M's. The mice didn't get the M&M's, Jeff. Mm. Wow, those still good. Good lucky day, bro. Yeah. I'm just going to take the whole thing. Eat the M&M's. Glasses. More Christmas, and then look at this. This dude's in there. It's 
missing his arm. Oh. As you're as you're starting to wind this down, some I know you got some more to go, but a lot to go, yeah. are you gonna are you going to uh, go back to Michigan? Is your Michigan trip worth it? I would go back to Michigan. I know that's money. Of course. Oh. Game controller. Another slingshot. It's like our fifth slingshot we found. Stephen King books. Ah, would that work with those BBs we found? Find out. Where's the BBs at? I don't know. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, I'm going to hand you the BBs. That would be really smart. I was waiting for you. Man, for Alva. The Walking Dead. So how many, how many comic books would you say is in a box like this size? Is that not 50 on a side? Is there 25 on a side? Oh, there's more. More than 50 on a side? Yeah, I would say probably more than 50. Depends on if they're bagged and boarded and all that stuff. So Some of more, these are thicker than... More than 100 in a box. And you've gotten so many boxes. But these are thicker, so you get less of them. So it just keeps going. Nineteen thirty-eight vintage Chevy mug. This is just a like glass, pink glass. It's a whole hodgepodge. I just ended up pulling out the coolest glass first. And here's another Stein. Thousand Christmas. Comics, comics, adult comics, adult comics. And who knows what else? Lady Duck. Crazy. This one's autographed right there. Cool. So, this guy was a mega, mega collector and had money. Looks like a Cadillac. Is that a Cadillac? Uh, yeah, the detail work this guy did to these models. He definitely had more patience than me. Yeah. And this box right here. That saved more time too. Yeah. Look at that paint job on there. Nice. Look at the metallic. So, poof. That's another. Two, four, six models. More books. The execution. These are all the execution. You ever read the execution? No. I don't read. That's true. More. Diecast. That's me. Seven Nomad. Bel Air. Nice. Set out models. Another six models in here. Wow, wow. Wowzers. This has a name on the bottom. Johan Models. Model Corp. I don't see this size. Pretty nice though. Another six, that's 12. Just to make sure comics look. Whole, whole mixture. Cable and Deadpool. Walking Dead. Okay. Ooh. Let's see something in here. In this it says Uzi. Oh, wow, that's pretty neat. Wow, that looks serious. How fast you can run, Jeff? Not very, that's true. 
Just hope you're not very accurate. Wow, 105 bucks it says. Oh, nice. No, knife. Nice. Knife, nice. Some kind of transformer thing. Transformers. Books. Video game. Hardcover books. All right here. Piece of jewelry. Oh, it's gonna be in this box. Ew. Ew. More skitties. That, that wasn't a G string, that was an S string. So we got books. Walking Dead guys. Gotta see if there's any more nice on there. A bunch of Star Trek books. Worth money to somebody. Well, let's bust open a safe. I bought this unit in Michigan because I thought it was going to be a safe bet. <laughs> uh, That's it. That was it. That was your big lead in. That was it. So. Everything else in the unit hasn't disappointed. I'm assuming there's something in this just because of everything else in the unit. But. I found I had the last case I've been disappointed in before. We've been waited. This is the very last thing that you've opened. I guess I should just lay it down. Huh? Yeah. I know. There's stuff in there. I heard it before. There's definitely something in there. Did Did you say your son was asking you? Yeah. What he think was in here? Maybe I should have left it up. Cause now all the crap is missing. You know what I'm saying? That's right. Why am I getting up close? <laughs> Boy, this brings back some memories. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's how I got my first nickname. How are you feeling? Feeling good. Feeling good. Got that adrenaline flow. Oh, you got this. We didn't do this in Michigan. <laughs> Can I throw out a suggestion? Yeah, I should have the same outlook. Try the try the short end in there and hammering the short end. Short end of what? This one? Or this one? Yeah, the short end. Yeah. This one? Yeah. Now hammer that. Just every time that thing gets aimed at me, I get a little head shy. I could have had this done by now, but he seems to be the professional and kind of amuse him, so we'll act like he knows what he's doing. Alright, so I brought grandpa and great granddad. Mm -hmm. 
This is called grandpa, because it's like a cane. So I used to call these grandpa. And I'd say, hey, go get me grandpa. That's what grandpa is. Just remember I'm on here. You know what I suggest? Or look at the other side. When you grow up, that other side opens up. If you could get the other pry bar on the other side. Try the other side open. Like when you, I don't know if you can push on it and get it started. Even I'd go opposite. Go, go exact opposite where your other one is. Yep. Once you get that out a little bit, that one will go in. Yes, yes, yes. No way. <laughs> what is it? Comic books? Wow. 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 What, if, what if you were to lay it on its Watch side up, now? Yeah. Let me stand on it again. I think if it doesn't hurt whatever's in there, if you lay it on its side and let gravity help that door open. Oh, yeah. Oh, here, Jeff, stand on this thing with me. Can I 
Can you sit on it? It's the same amount of weight. No, not on that. I need you to stand on the door. <laughs> oh, that's right. I'm the video. Can you stand on there? That's not going to flip, right? No. Go. Ready? Uh-huh. There it is. It's good enough. Oh, man. Oh, my. First off, we got a ring of 22. Looks like a 22. We gotta make sure that they're not loaded. It is empty. It's got the scope on it. Oh my god. Yeah, when we moved it, we it sounded like one gun moved one time and that was it. Look at that. That's all it's got the oh, bayonet. for it. Wow. Russian. Oh wow. Looks like World War One, I, I mean two. Oh wow. I don't know what this thing is. Oh. Simple lighter. Some kind of bag here. Ammunition. Shots and shells, 12 gauge. When you're shooting, you gotta have a little schnapps. Wow. Oh, man. Oh. Model 1917 Winchester. Chinese or Japanese? Looks like probably World War One. Well, we got five, four. We got one more in there. Oh, I got stuff up here too. How many? Well, one, two, three, four. Unlocked. Oh, Probably the key for the safe yeah. in here. It's a good place for it. There's different ammunition. <laughs> oh, I'm getting so excited. This ain't why. 45 shells. That's why. Oh, like that's jewelry. jewelry. In a safe? I see a watch, yeah. Might be good. 30 carbine. Another zip on lighter? Yep. Oh, man. Okay, how's this rank on your safe finds? Is this gotta be up Definitely there? one of the best. Gotta be up there. Definitely one of the best safes. Boom. I don't know. I haven't finished going through yet. I think in, you've opened enough of them with not stuff in them that you weren't excited. If you would have known this would have been in there, that would have been the first well, we thing. We moved it. It's only, it only sounded like there's something in it at one time, right? Yep. That's because everything was in in place right. Copper sounded shells, shells, shells. Still got this down here. Should be a 12 gauge Remington Express Magnum. It's 
not loaded. Use two three quarter or three inch magnum shells only. Twelve. So unbelievable. Great safe. There's still stuff down here. More ammunition. More shells. Tape. Not only did we find guns. Let's see what's inside here. I'm so excited. Wow. Did the guns pay for the locker? I don't know about that. Close. Say a gauge in the ring right here. Could be a diamond. I'll take off my gloves, just Jeff. Yeah, it's time. What an unbelievable unit. This is why I buy storage units. It's a pretty ring. Looks like it's a 14 carat. All kind of jewelry in here, another ring, that's in the diamond, sterling silver, man, Armatron watch, more sterling silver, another watch, Pulsar watch, $110, Price tag on it. Another watch. 14 karat gold filled. Another pulsar watch. I mean, this is just. I have no clue. Genuine diamond right here. Assuming this is gold right here. 24 inch stainless steel chain. Oh my gosh, it's just a whole sterling silver, sterling silver, sterling silver. Another watch. Gold rings, rings, earrings. Dollar bill, Canadian, more rings. Let me get, oh, it just keeps going and going and going. Wow, wow, wow. So I paid 1600 some dollars for the storage unit. Right here. 1659 dollars plus the buyer premium, bought this unit. I took a gamble. I took a three hour trip and I got firearms. I got gold collectibles, thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars. Guy hoarded weapons. Might be one of the best units I ever bought. So much fun. Appreciate you all watching. If you haven't seen other videos, gotta check them out. Share with your friends. Don't forget, give us a thumbs up. Help out the channel. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.